Hey guys, welcome back. Today, we'll be continuing our series on RimWorld, and we're gonna be chasing some pretty tough challenges. I hope you guys stick around to see what all happens. Anyways, hope you guys enjoy. Alright, so, coming right off of last episode. Gonna have Sammy here. Oh, he's escaping. <laughs> <sighs> Funny joke. Come on, Sammy, little boy. Don't you try to escape. Yep. Door's closed, buddy. Alright. And now we'll let him go. Alright. We're gonna have Sploosh here. Uh, start Gunsmith. We're also gonna have Sploosh equip the shotgun. Because they do a lot of damage. Not melee. Accuracy is not always the best, but meh. But it's the stopping power and damage I care about. Because a good revolver like this one, it doesn't have near as much stopping power. And it doesn't have basically any damage compared to that thing. I mean, it's explode, but you hit a shot with a shotgun. I mean, it took two shots to take down Mellow here. And of course, a guinea pig comes and screws him over, but we don't have to talk about that. We're also going to have a dumping stockpile zone of chunks. Right here, copy settings, paste settings. Yes, I realize there's a slaver. We'll get him in a second. Paste settings. And then settings. That will slow down anyone who does try to go through the doors because they uh, that's not always what they attack but sometimes they do so yeah. okay how long place your bets in the comments below how long do you think this slaver is going to stay here it doesn't matter, because we're going to have Mellow rest until healed. Maybe not until healed, but we'll have him rest for a bit. Because, quite frankly, I want to get a better deal with these. We're also going to have Sploosh here. Just, just look. Look what they have. Not that I think I'm going to buy anything from them, but... Might. Cannibal. Don't want him. Alright, we're not gonna buy anything. Um. We'll wait for a bit, then give them some gifts. Wait for Melo to heal some. Sploosh, clean up your surroundings. No one likes looking at this crap. Alright, you can meditate. I'll allow that. Then you go right back to resting. Read what are your sight focus? Okay, we'll have you get your sight focus a little higher. That way she can cast more pain blocks, which would be really nice. This stuff first. Alright, now your room looks a little better. It looks dull. <laughs> How comfortable does this make you, though? I don't know if I need to put a dresser. Yeah, I do. For all of them, then. Alright, get, get your jaw to better efficiency. 
Once we get there talking, we need the talking to get better. Because that's what I, I care about, it's, you know, talking. We'll get it to 50% and then give them a gift. Because I don't want them to leave. And time now. All right, never mind. Right now is the correct time. Hey, wait for me. No, no, no. Oh, I tried. Gonna need Mellow to get these graves dug. That way we don't just have bodies laying around because no one likes looking at that. I do hope we can get Tone to to Toe and Tone. I like Tone better. I do hope we can get them to like us though. Ideal. Reed, we're gonna have you clean that up and then all this stuff. Then we're gonna have you clean up the dining room. I need to. No. I don't know who's causing that. I guess we just are dirty people. Mello, you're the last one that needs to heal. Getting close to getting good though. Then we need you to repair things. That's actually what we're gonna have you set your priorities as. Hey, gunsmithing. We're just blasting through research. Things are getting repaired. It'll be way better deal. Can you repair the burn floor? Nope, we're gonna have to just add it. Just repairing. You know him. Hope you aren't hungry. Yeah, he's fine. All our wood stockpiles burned up in that fire too. So that's not good. We'll have all of this fertile soil in our wall. And we might have to, well, we will whenever we mine out this stuff, and this stuff we'll have to change the wall a little bit, but we'll burn that bridge when we get to it. Speaking of bridges, I had to put bridge here and here so the wall can go over. So whenever we, we can get around to it, we're gonna uh, research the moisture pump, but that'll be later on. It'll be like episode five or something like that. Darn it. <laughs> Darn it. When I put this growing zone, I guess I must have messed up and Well that's corn now. Three lone corn plants. Is this wall done? No. It's just working on this wall. Well that's fine. It choke points them at least. See now we can excuse me. Hmm. Ok, 
Can I build a wooden wall there? I can. Alright, I guess we'll just double layer it. Uh-huh. I really didn't know that. Good to know, I guess. This alpaca pack has moved from up here, kind of wandered down and came down. Also, you can see where this elephant pack went. It just <laughs> wandered all the way down. And you can see what they ate on the way down. See, now they're <laughs> they just eat everything. One more reason to have a wall. Read what's here. Yeah. It'll be fine. Got the shotgun equipped. Gonna have to have another power source. Probably a solar generator there. A little more, you know, dependable. My goodness, we're just blasting through. We'll have it here. They wonder why they have the 8 without table mood debuff. It's almost like they chose to eat without a table. <laughs> Who did that? Ah, he put on flak pants. No one touches the jacket. I guess I don't care if you touch the vest. Ah, yeah, I do. Got plenty of wood now, so that's a plus. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't all burn down in a fire again. Once we get these mini turrets done, we'll throw one here, over here somewhere, and then over here somewhere. And then once the wall's built, we'll add one outside of each door. So probably here here, here, and here. That way, it just covers the area, and hopefully we don't have to worry about it as much. Actually, we'll do a uh, mini turret, mini turret. That'll help. Where's our rhino? What's our rhino doing? Rhino, buddy. Ah, oh, you're outside the wall. I wonder how he'd feel if we just killed his friend. We'll have Sploosh go do <laughs> Sploosh put on the hat. What does it offer? It offers some good heat insulation. I'll accept it. Especially we're gonna have you come shoot some alpacas. See, two shots. Oh, Reed is doing it. Never mind. Never mind. No, you haul alpaca. You haul alpaca. Now we have some more meat. That looks really derpy and I hope I can fix that soon. Should be able to. Hello, what you doing? I guess you do you. You want to sit at a table and talk to yourself? Do it. I ain't gonna stop you.
Don't just drop it on the floor. Okay. <laughs> I have to sell some pistols off. Revolvers, my bad. Sploosh, you don't look too good with that hat. <laughs> but you know what? Who am I to judge? Got more power. Got that. We need to extend our wood stockpiles on. That's kind of impressive. He did. <laughs> this wall's almost completely complete. Single stick. So. This wall is completely complete. That's nice. To say the least. Sploosh wants to get done with that research. We'll get those mini turrets thrown up. Nice little break. Not having Raider just get thrown at us. Alright, what are we gonna do next? We're just gonna go ahead with the uh, microelectronics, gas operations, precision rifle. Then we're gonna get assault rifles for everybody. Or at least mellow. Right now, we're about outclassed. Alright, throw down our power conduits. Can it shoot over? I don't know if it can shoot over those, so we'll have it be uh, sandbags instead. And then one here. Okay. Got that side set up. We'll quickly run this through. Since I can't go through the mountain for whatever reason. Alright, get into the wall. Run up here. And then run down here. Alright. Power switch. That means now we can throw down our mini turret mini turret. Okay. Look at us getting all fancy. Yes. Elephant leather. That's the word I was looking for. From City Build. My goodness, is that all he could build? Is that... I guess we didn't have much. <sighs> Crap. Alright. Camel hide for you. We'll have you finish up with camel hide. And those other ones will have to use something else for a bit. We 
need to go hunt and get some more elephant. Um, this probably isn't a good idea. Actually, I know it isn't. Told you. <laughs> Run! <laughs> oh boy. Well, <laughs> how did you only shoot it in the leg? Shoot it. Yes. Did you? No, you didn't. Ah, run, 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 run. Nope, you just do a dance. You do a dance as well. Actually, no. 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 Yes. Crap, 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 crap. Shoot the elephant. <laughs> Well, shoot it. Ah, darn it. Please don't tell me it scarred you. Nope. You get to run. Run! Don't shoot the elephant. Determined elephant, I'll give it that. Hello, come hunt this elephant. Well, that was an experience. Who are you both equal? Seven, seven, yeah. Read. Well, oh, I guess you already did it. Man, they're really not that clean, cleansly. Yep, that word, clean. Not good at being clean. All right, that's an extra. Hundred elephant leather. So, how much is these? It's ten. That's fifty. So that'll work. Um, how much? We have another ten there. Wait, no, ten is five hundred. No. Fifty. My brain is so dead. Might cut that out. <laughs> and then elephant up here as well. And that one. A muffalo shaman. Steadfast is pretty good, but you're not you're not that good. You're not that interesting, dude. Hate to break it to you. It's been nice and kinda uneventful. But I'll happily take that right now. That's what I was gonna do. I was gonna add cooling to all of this. <sighs> Before I do that, we're gonna go ahead. How long are these? Seven. Seven. Boom. 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 I'll just do a cooler. Yeah, just a cooler will be fine. Turn it. Turn it. <laughs> Figured that might be an issue. Turn it. <laughs> Bugs me a lot. Maybe. Maybe it'll be fine. It should be fine. Sorry if the music's a little loud. I should probably turn that down a bit. Yeah, it's probably better. 
Still new to this. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no. Okay, it's mellow. Mellow. Guess what you get to do? You get to go rest. Sploosh. Guess what you get to do? <laughs> My goodness. He'll quickly freaking stabbed in the torso. Probably gut by an elephant. Let's see how that is. He should be fine, but we're gonna have him rest a lot. Because quite frankly, I don't want my dudes to die to malaria. Then you're gonna clean up his area. Sweaty. So yeah, it is hot in there. Good thing you're here. You're the one sick. <laughs> Good thing you're the one that's sick. That'll allow the AC to go through all of their rooms. Shaman merchant. Your talking's pretty well, perfectly fine. Here, go ahead. Go trade with them. These people should have something we're interested in. More so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Can't talk properly. He's like 2% down. Um. Gold is always something I like. Do we need our rhino? I don't know. Do we want our rhino? It's kind of old. But he might be good. Nah, we don't care about our rhino. We like gold more. <laughs> oh, what'd you do today? Oh, you know me, just... Trade in some rhinos for gold. Worth it? Probably not. But I'm gonna say it is. So this is a chart over our overall wealth. And right now, I kinda don't wanna get above 35,000 yet. Our buildings are going up, which is good, but we need the items to not go up too much. Critters, whatever, they're fine. But. Transport car. Alright. Alright, we don't want them. Um. <laughs> maybe we do. No. No, we don't. Because she's from Toon, too, so we can release her. So. We're going to do the thing we did before with that raider. Sploosh. Uh, Reed, what you doing? Alright, whatever. You can come capture her. How close is she to bleeding out? She should be fine. Reed, go on. She'll be fine. What kind of gear she got? So, <laughs> the goal of this game is to leave the room world, is to leave here. And this is one of the options to leave this planet. You have to go all the way from here, or all the way from us to there. Pretty well on the exact opposite side of the world. See us right Right there, the lighter blue. It's over here, the exact opposite side of the world. As it always does, so. Probably won't be making that journey. We'll probably just be building a ship here. But we'll see. 
Sorry, little rhino buddy. I loved you. No, not rhinoceros one. Not poor rhinoceros one. Cobra, we need to kill it. Mel, how you feel? Sick, sick. Aw, oh, don't make fun of the hospital. <laughs> so yes, this is something you can do in this game. You can just melee a snake and be fine. A, a cobra, to be exact. And now it just got up. <laughs> this game's perfect. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Just some extreme blood loss. And as soon as we can... We will release you. We're also going to clean this place up again. No. Once you get to maybe 50%, I'll see where you're at. Come on. Come on. So turn off yourself, tent. Sploosh. Sploosh, I know you want to. You can't tend now. Tent. So now he's at a way better tank quality, so he'll gain immunity faster. Even though I don't know exactly what you tend. His sickness. I mean, like antibiotics, yeah, but it's not exactly tending. Got one mini turret up. That's nice. I'm gonna cut these off, though. You know, if I had been smart, I would have put the power line up here, but it's fine. Oh, Cobra went down. Gonna die. What'd you have for gear? I forgot to look. Might stripper. Which are you worth? $181? Yes, please. Can she walk yet? No. She can't. Whatever, Mello. Hmm. I mean, he'd be fine. Mello would be perfectly fine if I just let him go right now. But at the same time... Don't know. Hey, you need to get on top of... Uh, painting. We're gonna turn this all to... Because that stuff's getting close. Kitchen's always a mess. Now we got flu. Oh my goodness. Alright. Come on over. Come on, little doggy do. Come on, go rest. Come on. Yeah. You'll be okay. I hope. Alright, yeah, she'll be fine. You walk yet? I mean, <laughs> not really. <laughs> Spoosh. 
I want to get all that stuff. Reed, you really need to get on top of the whole, like, thing you're supposed to be doing. Like, we have plenty of food right now. Come on. Don't need you to cook. I'll have you cook less. Alright, Mellow. How are you doing? Yep, you'll be fine. He'll be able to gain back all his immunity before he's in trouble. And Crumb? Crumb will, will be fine, but he'll be closer than I wished. Bloosh. What's our wealth at? Okay, it hasn't gone up too much. That's good. Guinea pig. It's gonna attack us. I can just feel it. You guys, keep this guinea pig in mind. <laughs> if it comes back, kills one of us, I'm not gonna be a happy camper. Alright, so hostile right now. Still hostile, but there's gonna be less attacks. Hopefully we can capture another one of their people and release them. As horrible, of, <laughs> as, horrible as that sounds. Confused? Ah, we do have that turned off. Well, I'm gonna pause the recording and if anything interesting happens, I'll come back. If not, I'll come back whenever this all gets finished. Well, I just set up a growing zone, and then we got a quest, so we're going to see what this quest is all about. We can get this person here, and I... <sighs> we're not going to take her, because again, no iron weld, and these two traits right here, the shooting and animals and the cooking, uh, are all really, <laughs> really nice but she can't provide medical assistance and she's older she's at 50 so we are not going to we'll take it for goodwill so what this is uh we have to capture or we have to hold these uh two prisoners for 23 days we can do that Under an anesthetic for now. We'll need to keep an eye on her mind. Because if he decides he needs to break out, then we may have a not so good time. Alright, Mello, you're gonna do that. Put these two in there just that way they can't cause problems, and then we're gonna have him start working on this, and we're gonna turn those into a prison for just a second. Have some prison bedrooms. We're also gonna have Reed do some snip snipping. Alright, cool. That's not what I want you to do right now. We're gonna have you go over here. And Sploosh is gonna deliver wood. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Reed can do whatever right now. I don't really care. Just so long as all of this can be ready fast. It'll be a good day. Oh, hey!
it's not reserved for prisoners anymore. Yeah, how about that? Yeah, just barf all over, why don't you? Oh, are you good on sleep? You are a quick sleeper, so be fine. Well, they all are, but. Cool. Things are getting done. Oh, yeah, how's Crumb? Not as close as could be, so. Doing better. Well, actually, that's a lie. Actually, more sick, but. <laughs> well, I'll come back once this gets finished and we move these people over. <sighs> Another raid, but it is from. Uh, these people. Tona again. No, it's not. It's from the uh, white boar. Tona. So, they are all um, they're all uh, not well equipped, to say the least. So this is our best option. But all she has in store for us is shooting and plants. And his iron will. She can't even cause medical, so we're just gonna kill him. Pretty simple. We also just finished this. So, we'll move these two over. No, don't strip. Right there, doing it. He's doing it. Whenever they start attacking, we'll get ourselves in position. Just, Mellow, what are you doing? No. Then you're gonna build roof areas. Alright, we need these two to get ready. We'll build them up here. Also, go flick this on just in case. Nice. Where are they at? Oh, they're going around that side. That's better. We'll have them base up like I told them to. Reed is up closest with Sploosh, then Mellow. Excuse me? Excuse me, what? I don't have those claimed. Okay, well, that kind of makes a change of plans. Not really. It really doesn't change plans too much. Same plan. Shoot people. Now you need to snipe people off. Like, fast. You. Take them on. You. That's gonna blow up. It's gonna kill me. Nice. Go get him. You! Are a total douche. 
Yeah. Get him, Crumb. Alright, Reed, whatever. You just back off. Don't worry about it. Sploosh. Get the guy. Read, go on. Krum, how are you? Okay, only bruises. Alright. Well, that was a little closer than I was hoping. Or, because I was an idiot and forgot to uh, claim those doors. So, let me explain for those who don't know how Room World works. Um, because I did not have these claimed, it classified them as uh, objects that don't pose any stopping ability. Because it's just a door. I mean, it's not a locked door. It's not a door owned by us. It's just a door. So, they just open the door. <laughs> to put it simply. So then now, now that it's claimed, they won't be able to just walk through. They'll have to go around, which is what I was planning for. That's why I was a little confused. Well, more than a little confused. But hopefully, that won't happen next time. But anyways, now that Reed's patched up, Crumb is getting patched up, I think it's good to go. Let's just see how the flu is. Fine. Well. <laughs> Not an eventful episode to the end there. But that's merciless difficulty for you. You can get giant raids. That wasn't even that big. That was an easy raid. And I just wasn't prepared. So that's probably going to be next episode. It's just all defense. Anyways, see ya.